Welcome to our guide on WhatsApp broadcast messages. In this video, we'll explore what WhatsApp broadcast is, how to create a broadcast list, the limitations of WhatsApp Business App, and why you should use WhatsApp Business API for broadcasting. But first, let's understand what WhatsApp broadcast is. WhatsApp broadcast allows you to send a message from a single source to multiple recipients simultaneously. It's a convenient way to reach out to your audience without the recipients seeing each other. Now, let's understand how to create a WhatsApp broadcast list in two simple steps. Step one, start by selecting the contacts you want to include in your broadcast list. You can either choose them individually or upload a list in a CSV format. Step two, organize your contacts into relevant groups based on factors like interests or location. This segmentation helps in sending targeted and personalized messages. Sounds easy, right? But there's a catch. WhatsApp Business, despite its message broadcasting feature, has serious shortcomings that can prevent small and medium-sized businesses from fully utilizing the WhatsApp broadcast feature, thus limiting their potential for business growth. Let's have a look at these limitations. First off, there's the broadcast limit. You can only add up to 256 contacts in a single broadcast list. Secondly, recipients must have saved your number in their contacts to receive your broadcast messages. Third, the WhatsApp Business app may restrict the type of content you can send in broadcasts, such as promotional material. Fourth, while you can see who has received and read your messages, the analytics provided by WhatsApp Business are relatively basic compared to other platforms. But don't worry, there's a way to navigate all these limitations, and that is through WhatsApp API and WhatsApp Business Solution Partner. So, what is WhatsApp API? In 2018, WhatsApp launched the WhatsApp Business API, aimed at assisting small and medium-sized businesses in communicating with their customers on WhatsApp. To activate their business numbers for WhatsApp APIs, businesses need to undergo a verification process. However, WhatsApp alone cannot verify every business globally. To address this challenge, WhatsApp provided its APIs to third-party service providers known as WhatsApp Business Solution Partners, or BSPs. BSPs have developed systems over the WhatsApp Business API, offering features such as WhatsApp CRM, contact management, and more. With WhatsApp API-enabled business numbers, platforms like Wati can broadcast your WhatsApp messages to thousands of customers simultaneously. Businesses can also utilize alternative methods like using Excel or Google Sheets to send bulk WhatsApp messages, providing flexibility in communication strategies. There are several advantages to using WhatsApp APIs, including reliability, automation, multiple agent support, and the possibility of green tick verification. One of the biggest advantages of WhatsApp APIs is that you can integrate chatbots on your business numbers, automating sales and customer support processes efficiently. That was it. WhatsApp API opens the floodgates of opportunities when it comes to WhatsApp broadcast features. So what are you waiting for? Try Wati and reach out to thousands of prospects via Wati's WhatsApp broadcast feature today. If you liked this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Until next time.